So in the past, I guess, well, about a year and a half ago, or maybe a year ago, uh, Cell Vinyl got discontinued. And it was kind of the paint that all the sign, the splash artists use. And uh, I've used it, I used it for 20 years or more. But I switched to this Ronin Aqua Coat, which works pretty good. And also I'd add a little bit of golden fluid acrylic to it. But it was a little bit heavy. And uh, this, this patio paint that I used worked really good. The DecoArt patio paint black, it was just super smooth. So I'm hoping the, um, the Americana multi-surface paint will, uh, will work just as good. So let's give it a go. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and try out the DecoArt Americana multi-surface paint. This is the satin finish. And uh, here it is here. And uh, I've been using the, the DecoArt uh, patio paint paint the wrought iron black and it seems fine I really enjoy it but this one comes in eight ounces which is better because I'll probably use more of it so I'm gonna go ahead and try this out they said this it says multi-surface acrylic paint and uh, this is black tie is the name of this uh, color but they, they said this stuff's even tougher so <laughs> we're gonna try it out add some water to it and go for it okay I got my little uh, my little outlining brushes and I'm going to take some of this and uh, squirt a little bit in here and then add some water. Get a, a fluid consistency. Okay, let's go for it. Hey, decoration! Okay, I can already see that this isn't covering as well as the the other paint, the Deco Art uh, patio paint. It just it seems more opaque. See that there. Because you have to be able to thin down the paint. And this doesn't cover quite quite as good as the other stuff. So 
I'm going to switch back to the, the wrought iron black, see if I got any of that left. I'll try that and show you the difference. Hey, how are you? How are you? I'm glad it's not stormy. <laughs> i got to hurry and get it done. I know. Okay. Here's more of the wrought iron black. Now watch this. Pretty smooth. Luscious lines. This is cool here. You can start off really thin and push down and then lift up. Create a really cool thick and thin Disney line. So you just push down and then lift up. Then the, for the more detailed stuff, I'm taking my little outliner. But yeah, this paint's really nice. All right. Be nice. <laughs>